Hey Tech Junkies, welcome to the Tech Show. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to get theme music to play in the background um, whenever you go into like a TV show or you have several movies in a collection, it'll play music like this here. All right, um, this works the same for TV shows and movies. I'm gonna be using Ghost Whisperer because I don't have the theme music for Ghost Whisperer right now. So what you wanna do is go into um, add-ons. We're gonna need to get the add-on called TV Tunes. All right, and just um, download this. Once you get done at downloading it, you're gonna wanna go into Programs and you're gonna to wanna to go over to TV Tunes. First, you wanna configure it. So, we're gonna go into add-on settings. And we're gonna to go to play theme in a loop. We want it to play themes when browsing movie list, play themes when browsing TV show list, play themes when, if you wanted to do all this stuff, just click it. I do, so I'm clicking all this good stuff here. All right, and we're gonna go over to download and it'll, search for movie themes and then show TV tunes button in the info screen. Now, if you have it integrated into your skin, I'm not sure if, I think Aeonox is supposed to, Aeonox 5 has it integrated. I haven't seen it, but I really haven't looked for it. So it'll be in your info screen if your theme has that. So we're just gonna press okay. All right, now we're gonna want to go into TV tunes. Once you're in TV tunes, you're gonna to wanna to go to TV shows or movies, depending on which one you're looking for. So I'm gonna go into TV shows. I'm going down to Ghost Whisperer because I don't have Ghost Whisperer. All right, it's gonna look for um, the theme music. So I'm gonna click this one, it's the first one, and we're gonna see if this is right. So that's right, we're gonna download it. It's yes, to download. It's gonna automatically download this into your TV show folder or whatever folder you have this saved in on your computer, which is really cool how it automatically does that for you. So we're gonna go back and we're gonna go look at Ghost Whisperer now and see what it did. All right, so we go and it's gonna play the music for all this. Go in. Ooh. All right, it's a little bit of a lag, but all right, so there's the theme music, guys. I think I'm gonna turn it off whenever I'm looking through. Yeah, that's a little annoying. Okay, so uh, we're gonna go back, and I'm gonna show you guys the um, back side of it. Actually, we're gonna go fix that now because that's really annoying. Okay, so TV tunes. Uh, oh, wait, no, we don't wanna do that. We need to go into configure because there's too much of a lag. I probably wouldn't be if I wasn't recording, but that's still a little bit annoying. So, I'm gonna say okay. And now we're gonna go out of XBMC and I'm gonna show you guys where this stuff is stored or how you would wanna save it if you're downloading them yourself. Um, you can add these things in from your own collection, like, like if you want to download it um, for one that's not that TV Tunes is not fine for you. This is how you would save it in the file. So The Walking Dead, um, I have theme music within the Walking Dead folder. So I have theme.mp3, save it in there. Um, same thing for what it did for Ghost Whisper. It automatically saved it in here for me as under theme.mp3. Now, if you have movies, um, let's say you have a movie collection that um, has theme music like, let's see, where is Toy Story? That's a good one. One of my favorite, like, Disney movies. All right, so you go into the collection folder and you're gonna have the theme music in the collection folder. If you wanted to play just with one movie, you would put it in that movie, but I don't want it to play just when I look at that one movie. I want it to look, play whenever I look at the whole collection. For example, I'll show you guys this inside of XBMC. So we'll go to movies and we'll go over to Toy Story. All right, and click on that and it'll play the whole time you're in the folder, which I think that's pretty cool. Um, so that's how you do that. So you can download any, anything, any MP3 you can turn into um, theme music. Like for Sister Act, I'm gonna download one of the songs that they sing 
um, from my sister at collection which it's a pretty cool movie if you haven't seen that it's it's really funny uh, but I don't have theme music for that yet and it's a collection so I'm gonna go get that and just save it inside of here as theme.mp3 um, but yeah guys that's how you get theme music works the same way for TV shows or movies just make sure it's saved in the right place um, I highly recommend TV tunes it'll help you out it's a lot like fan art um, grabber it's a great app to get um, but if you guys have any questions, please post down below. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye.